welcome to Fancy Nancy LV today. We're doing something a little different today. We are going to Sam's Club to do our, I guess, mid month, not even mid month, just we need groceries. So this is where we're going and I'm gonna take you with me to show you how I shop for my family since not only do I love to eat, but I love to cook too. So come on with me to Sam's Club. Yeah. Wow, how cute are these? Oh, they have all the things for Thanksgiving at already. Right here. Oh, I can't wait for my phone to make bread pudding for the holiday. This is the best. Look at my Oh, that's so cute. Oh, who was it, Abby? Kevin. Kevin. The Gala Apples, the $4. We're right back. And yes, guys, of course, there's all the Christmas decorations. And obviously, I just showed you all the Thanksgiving stuff that is in the front. I feel like we have just squished Thanksgiving out the way already and it hasn't even happened. And it's all Christmas already. Look at all those beautiful decorations. Just gorgeous. Wish I had uh, the front door so I could just the front of a house where I could just put all of those. And look at this. I'm just daydreaming that this would be my own personal jewelry box. Or maybe I'm just hint hinting to the hubby what that I might, I don't know, might like something from here. One or two things I might like from there. But yes, as we continue, you see all the other Christmas decorations. Okay, guys, and you know, of course, I got to show you the toys because, you know, Christmas is around the corner. And, you know, a lot of people just think you can go on Amazon and Walmart, which there's nothing wrong with that. But Sam's Club has amazing deals on toys. Look at that $20 toys. I love the whole little vacuum thing. I'm waiting for them to make a little baby Dyson for kids because I'm going to get it. All these little baked kids. Everything was like those big toys were like $20 and under. Look, Fortnite. If your kids love Fortnite, they had all these things i love those little food things um my granddaughter is not gonna watch this video because she's only three years old so i'm planning on getting her a kitchen with little food for her for her to have at our house when she comes over on the weekends and i would love to buy the unicorn but you know i have bentley too so i have to buy a neutral little horse for them to jump on and do everything they do but just such cute things they had moana i actually purchased those double babies with the stroller for my granddaughter for her birthday and she absolutely loved them and who does Look at that that is so cute one of those little like teepee things with the little uh tent things i thought that was so cute they just have oh look there it is the little teepee just such cute things for the kids at very reasonable prices my granddaughter has that vanity and she absolutely loves it only thing though uh, if you're the kind of parent that doesn't like to put things together um don't buy things that are hard to put together because that was a little complicated but um or maybe i'm just like uh not a very good put together person because I, my daughter did it and it took her like a long time because I don't like those things. I'd rather pay extra and just have somebody assemble it for me. But yes, see all the little kitchen and the little register. I just think it's so cute. These interactive play things for kids. They're so in right now and it totally entertains them, which is a plus, plus, plus for all parents. Look at that. I wanted that for myself. I'm like, I could totally play in that. Okay, so my goal is to have a game room for the grandkids, and I'll have that in there. And of course, we have to show Elsa and Anna. Why wouldn't we? The kids have been obsessed with Frozen for years since it came out. And now there's a Frozen 2 coming out. Thanks, Disney. So we get to buy a big pillow like that. Anyways, that's a good a good size pillow for the kids. But these throws are so soft and nice. And they're only $12.98. And you know they have the sheets at Sam's Club. And then this. I'm gonna have to buy this next time. I didn't buy it this time because I was like, oh, maybe it's too sweet. But that looks really good. Funky, chunky, sea salt, caramel. Oh my gosh. I didn't say it was healthy, but it looks good. It looks good. I think next time I go back, I'm picking up a bag 
and I think I'm gonna stash it because then everybody else will take it. But of course, you have your all the other things that normally Sam's Club has. They always have good deals on like the the comfy things that you wear. The they have slippers. They have clothes for the kids. Always at really reasonable prices. Prices which I really like because you know when you have multiple kids to buy for you, you're on a budget. So you know, look at this though. I thought that was so cute for eleven ninety eight for like pictures with a little purse and I could just see my little granddaughter wearing it with some furry little boots. Oh, I just can't wait. So I think I'm gonna get that. I don't know why they still had Halloween stuff out, but it should be on clearance if it was out. But look at this, guys. I'm going to get her this because, look, it comes with an outfit for their doll. Is that not so precious? So you and your little baby doll can be dressed the same. Just the cutest. This is how they get me with all the cute little kid stuff they have. But they have really reasonable prices. And that's what I like because kids wear and tear things a lot. I didn't show the price, but I think that costs like $7.98, which is like under $10. You can get a nice little sweater like that. And look at this. Fuzz. I love this one. It's like, oh. So cute. I love that kind of stuff. I'm telling you, they gave me so many ideas for Christmas that I cannot wait to get all these things. I'm telling you, I wish that I wasn't buying food today because I would be buying gifts. And these costumes were leftover Halloween costumes, which were like a major clearance. So if you're that kind of person that likes to buy for the next following year, now is the time there because I had all these fall things and clearance things on sale. But such cute things for the kids. Always a winner. Look at that on um, costume. Hmm. I'm sure it'll still be hot next October. And look, I found a planner, you guys, which uh, I've been trying to be more organized. So I definitely needed a planner. And I thought, okay, if I'm going to start using a planner, don't spend a lot of money on it. Just get one. So I bought this one because I'm going to attempt to be more organized. So for $8, I can do it. So are we getting, we already got our apple. Do you want Granny Smith? Yes. So one of the favorite things I'd love to get, not just from Sam's Club, but in bulk period, is like produce. I love these cucumbers and they last so much longer than the other cucumbers that might be on sale for like four for a dollar these just last longer and they're only like three bucks so it's a really good deal and i really really enjoy their taste and my favorite tomatoes right now are these greenhouse like tomatoes they're just so juicy and they're perfect not just for salads for slice on your sandwiches but they are also good when i make salsas when i cook or every and everything they have really great flavor so this is a really good and these tend to last longer I don't know if it's because they're in that little tray or something I don't know but they last longer and it's one of my favorite things to get and of course we always buy like something like little breakfast pastries and try to switch it up like this time I'm getting the little mini cinnamon rolls because that's always been very popular at the house so I'm getting those right now and then you will see that my husband gets the Madelines because we absolutely love those and this is something very easy for the grandkids to snack in and it's small and I don't need to buy like big portions look they had the peppermint bark already I was really checking out that fudge but I was like don't do it girl don't do it. That's going to make a mess at the house. So there we go. We got the Madelines and now we're on to get some fruit. So of course it's cold in there. So I don't really like going in there, but everything that um, we need is in there. So I have to go. Okay. So I don't know about you guys, but right now I've been taking lunch to work and I discovered that they have really great and cheap salad kits at Sam's club, like $2 and 28 cents. If I were to buy a salad where I'm um, having my training right now, it would literally cost me like $8. And this was $2.28 and that kale salad was absolutely delicious. It had like pumpkin seeds and cranberries and that Caesar salad kit fed my whole entire family for dinner, which is very, very good. And of course, we always get strawberries here because they have a very, very good price. If I go to my regular like Albertsons where I get like small items, it's like $5 for a small tray. So it's always a good, good deal for me to get fruit at Sam's Club. So now guys, we're on to the meat. So for us, it's very budget friendly to buy our packs of chicken or meat or anything here at Sam's Club. They always, not only is it really good, but it's really, really reasonable. I don't understand why they charge so much more. And you know, the packages are way bigger. Of course, my husband has to always organize the cart like perfect, which I guess I, I shouldn't take for granted because 
it makes everything neat and nothing gets squished but yes so we are actually getting like boneless skinless chicken thighs some drumsticks we're also going to end up getting some chicken breast because these are all i can use do many recipes with this and they love these um uh kind of like tenderloins that they have there too we also got these chicken wings because they're oh we ended up not getting them i don't know if we did let me see. Oh, yes, we got them. Okay, yeah, so we got those there. And then we also got, like, the chicken tenderloins because we had bought them before and they ended up being really good. I think, what did we do with them? Oh, we can actually, like, further make chicken fingers or we can make them smothered in gravy or we can bake them and use them for salads or I can put them in soup. There's just so many variety of things that we can do. Now, one of the my favorite things from here also is um, they have these little short ribs that you see that we will get. Oh my God, you guys, are those, those are so good. Oh my goodness. The last time I bought these, we didn't even have enough for everybody. So I'm buying like a big pack today. They're so good. So quick to cook and so good. I just literally season them and I pour some Italian dressing, fresh onions and garlic in it and I bake them and they're so good. So, so good. Such a really, 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 really yummy, easy meal. And my family loves these. I'm actually making like a double, I'll buy two packs for Thanksgiving and these, for, and I'm gonna make those. But those are for like rows. So I'm buying those there because uh, this is my first time buying these here. I normally get these at Albertsons, but it was about the same price and they look like really, really, really good quality. So I'm buying those here because, of course, I can make pot roast beef stew. I can make um, Mississippi pot roast is actually one of my favorite things to make that. So that's what we bought those. And yes, it's a lot of me, you guys. But believe me, this family eats it. We eat that stuff. So this is where you buy really good meats for really good prices so that's why i like sam's club or as a matter of fact i think as a big family i have to shop somewhere like this because it would just be way too much money anywhere else but look what i discovered you see that it's like diced pork taco meat my mother-in-law doesn't eat pork but um for a treat i think i might come get that one day and just make a dinner it's only like eight dollars if i bought my family all tacos it'd be way more than that and they have like carne asada already like seasoned and it's about the same price when you break it up than what you would get at the regular hispanic store and that beef triptych looks really really good so as i do my hauls you will see i change it up depending on what i want to cook and i don't necessarily plan out my meals but i have a very good idea in my head when i come to buy meats and stuff of what i'm going to be making with this you know, I always see different things that I'm like, oh, next time I'll get this. Like when I make gumbo, these puppies are going in there. I'll definitely share that video because it's not my recipe. It's from Cooking with Carolyn and it's absolutely delicious. So I was looking at those frozen, uh, this, this right here. My mom used to make this really good like seafood soup out of these. And I think I'm going to attempt to make it one day. Not this time, but soon. Soon I will attempt to make that because it's one of my daughter's favorite things. And it has really yummy things in it. And um, I like that tilapia pack, but my mother-in-law doesn't like it frozen. She likes it fresh. And then um, Kevin's been asking lately my husband to make like scallops. And you see how those scallops were huge there? I'm going to have to come get it from. But I also like this bag of, of shrimp that I get there. It's only like $13, $14. And I'll make like shrimp. I can make shrimp alfredo with it. I can make, I've made jambalaya like twice with them and they're very good quality and they're very nice size. So I really like it. So we're on to get some other stuff, guys. I'll stop talking now. Bye. These trays are just the kind of things I like and great for entertaining. Like, oh, they have like crunchy pickles. This is where you would find like all your stuff if you were doing like a charcuterie cheese board with marinated olives. Hey, kimchi, love that stuff. But if you were doing that kind of stuff, it's all in this section because they have the cheeses and the prosciutto meats and the salamis and all that kind of stuff. We're 
first and fifth move for the head to hold in the air. These are the best steps, you guys. You know you gotta check them, make sure none of them are broken. If you watch to the end, you will see that we actually have a budget for this shopping trip because, of course, you have to have a budget. But let's see if we were actually able to make that budget. So make sure you stay to the end and you'll see if we hit our budget. It's actually $300. Let's see if we hit it. I like how you organize the cart. It's a very good thing, Mr. Johnson. I like it. It makes it look pretty. We need bread. Bread, bread, right here. That's what we like. Well... I like everything, but that's what my family likes. Okay. Paper towels and tissue. <sighs> okay. Okay, so this is, let me tell you the scenario why we buy so much food. So Monday through Friday, there's literally six adults and one baby in my house. And on the weekends, there is seven adults and two babies in our home. So this is why we have to buy a lot of food. But the good thing is, even though our kids, they're grown, they all help out. So this is, it isn't just on me and on dad and I, although it was for many years. So. We are very happy that they help out, but we make sure to get everything and make it easier and we try to we try to work as a family, you know. It's tough. For those of you who have big families, you would know. But um it somehow works out. So we love it. Cauliflower rice, your noodles. I like these fruit these broccoli florets. This is a good buy for me here. Because I like to make them. This is a good buy for me. Or in the freezer, I can make all kinds of, of things with them. Okay, how about it? Okay. Do you want to see if there's ground beef? Yeah, they have Elsa frozen waffles. Babe, they have an Elsa pillow that is like literally so cute. <laughs> what are those, Kevin? Oh, we have a good. These are so, so good. Good, good thing. We need lunch meat. Turkey. We don't need turkey bacon because we have some. We need turkey, turkey. Here, love turkey breast. Okay, what else? Wow. You got this. <laughs> oh, choose this. These little, these little lemonades. They like the sunny D's. They like the sunny D's. Uh, Aaliyah loves them. All right, here you go. So we don't need the ground beef for now. We have plenty of stuff to make. We can always come back. Yeah, that's true. All right. So this is everything? Yeah. Okay. Stop. All right. So this is everything for now, you guys. How long do you think this lasts, Mr. Johnson? Maybe two, some things, three weeks? Mm -hmm. Some things, two weeks? A month. We have to pick up odds and ends here and there. Yep. But not bad. Not bad for a quickie that we had to do. And we get it done pretty quick because, you know, 
He's checking his course, but we get it done pretty quick. So yay! it for today's Sam's Club haul. You see everything that we got. If you like these type of videos, I know it's something different than what I normally do, but if you like them and you want to see more shop or hauls with me, leave a comment down below. I'll, I'll bring you along with me, no problem. So until next time guys, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment down below, and thank you all for the ones that come back and actually watch my videos. Thank you. Big thank you from all of us. We highly appreciate it. And that's it for now, Mama Sushi. Thank you. Okay, now it's time to pick. See you guys in the next one. Bye. Our budget was 300 and look how close we can. Wow. And this is just, this is not the whole month. Well, I don't need to feed a family, but so we booked it.